Hello and welcome to Virtual Curriculum Night for LA Foundations. This is your students' fourth or fifth period in their schedule. And we'll go over a little bit about what we do every day. About the teacher, my name is Miss Conway or Kelly Conway. I am a Mercer Island native. That is my IMS Gator card from when I went here in sixth grade and seventh and eighth. Um, I am a proud dog mom of my lab Daphne. If I look familiar, it is because I worked at Northwood in Island Park before coming to IMS. I've actually gotten to see a few Northwood students that I worked with back then. So it's been nice to see them grow up. And this is my first year teaching at IMS and I look forward to helping your students progress towards their goals. What is LA Foundations? First, our schedule is this. We start with our daily prompt. This is to get their brains working and ready for writing. Then we will go on to grammar. And then we do a whole group lesson, depending on what our, goal, our plan is for that month or week. And then we will do reteaching or review of previously taught skills. You may hear your student use the term passion project. This is a student selected writing project that they can do if they finish a task early. This could be writing song lyrics, short stories, reviews, or research projects. Um, some of them are very, very excited about it. So I hope that you hear or you get a look at their passion projects at some point this year. What sort of things do we work on? Well, our whole group lessons are largely influenced by IEP goals in the class and aligned and adjusted with the general ed education language arts team. We will start with Washington State history and then transition to novel studies. The instruction is tailored to each individual child's needs. We work to challenge your student at the level they are, as well as try to push them farther. And uh, then we do work on writing a literary paragraph, which is a paragraph that has a topic sentence or a claim, then a concrete detail, some commentary, and ending with a conclusion statement. So tips for a successful school year. Check Schoology daily. Skyward is not frequently updated or as frequently updated, I should say. And complete all classwork. The big, huge school-wide initiative that we have this year is that homework is not heavily graded. Um, all of our grades basically come from classwork. So making sure your student gets all of the classwork done would be very beneficial for them. And if your student finds themselves overwhelmed, ask for help. I can be very flexible. I want to make sure that I know what your student is learning and where they're at. If they don't understand something or if the workload is too much for them, that is something that I would love to know so that I can help tailor it so that it can fit their needs. IEP meetings, just a reminder, um, IEP meetings are set through your child's manager, case manager. Input and collaboration with you and your student is greatly valued. You guys know your student better than anybody else. Um, so anything that you have to, any concerns, any best tips is greatly valued. And also your student is invited to participate. Uh, it is their individualized plan. So having them there really does help uh, have them understand what their goals are and help have them give input for their, their goals. So please contact me with any questions. My name is Kelly Conway again. That's my email down below. Um, I'm happy to work with you and your student so that we can have the best year possible. Here's to 2021 and 2022. <laughs> have a great year.